second focus and second directrix. Now basically what this means in an ellipse we are having two focus and two directrix. Okay? The line in the blue is the directrix as in a parabola we were having only one focus and one directrix. Okay? Same in the ellipse we are having two focus and two directrix. Okay? So let me explain you now. Since this ellipse, okay, since the ellipse is symmetric to y axis, this ellipse, this is this is also symmetric to y axis. Now, if on the x axis the points s dash and z dash are taken already i have marked it s z s dash sorry not z s dash and z dash and these points are on the x axis are taken then then s dash is also a focus of an ellipse and l dash m dash and l dash m dash this point l dash m dash means this straight line and L dash M dash the line passing through Z dash this point line is passing through Z dash and perpendicular to z c z dash z point of the first directrix then c be the center and z dash okay perpendicular to z c z dash such that such that now what we are having distance of c s dash is equal to distance of C S is equal to A E and we are having distance of C Z dash is equal to distance of C Z is equal to A upon E then L dash M dash will be the corresponding directrix of an is it clear now this is what this was the equation of the directrix we have already done it ok so distance between c s dash and c s is equal to a e and c z dash and c z is equal to a upon e ok so c s dash c s dash and c s and from c to s ok so now what this shows now this shows that the ellipse has two foci that are plus minus a e comma 0 and two directrix that are x is equal to plus minus a upon e. I have already mentioned x is equal to negative of a 
x is equal to positive of a e for coordinates of the focus a e comma 0 and negative of a e comma 0 is it clear so that's why we are saying second focus and second directrix